Okay, I'm recording. Yeah. So um, I asked this uh, lovely question on guilt. Um, Hawkins has done a lot of uh, research, muscle testing research, and um, you could, I mean, the, the course talks about fear and guilt. And the message behind guilt is that I require punishment. Uh, so if you have a guilty feeling, your ego will try and latch on to your thoughts and behaviors which mimic uh, punishment because that's the feeling that's identified with that thought and um, however from muscle testing it's if, if you like the grades of fear are um, the densest grade of 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 emotion which the most ego dense emotion is actually shame uh, and then it's uh, and then it's uh, guilt and then you have things like uh, sloth and fear and then pride, uh, no, anger and then pride. So, you know, like if you're feeling angry, that's more than uh, feeling fearful, you know. Um, so there's different uh, qualities to the vibration. Generally speaking, I mean, I'm an addict um, and um, addiction is really using the world, something in the world to escape my feelings and repress them. Um, so I would always eat donuts or do other addictive behaviors to make sure I never got to experience my feelings. And so they all got repressed. So while working 12 step programs, it's like those feelings that I used uh, various addictions from, from donuts and food to TV, to um, uh, dependency issues with humans, uh, all of that stuff meant there was so much repressed feelings because those were mechanisms to avoid feeling my, uh, most of my life. So, so when you stop all those behaviors, uh, for me, the, all the repressed feelings come up like a, like a volcano. And uh, uh, yeah, definitely um, uh, they can come up actually in different orders, but uh, I would say that um, uh, you're probably going to be the, the guilt is a deeper, it's a deeper layer of stuff. And it, once you let, you know, you might let, let go of uh, guilt and shame. And then uh, instead of feeling guilty all the time, you might be feeling fearful. It's a higher, uh, it's a higher vibration. And then after you let go of the, all the, most of the fear, you might be feeling prideful, maybe prideful that you let go of the fear and the guilt. Uh, and then as you let go of the, the pride, you might get to neutrality. So all those repressed feelings, um, uh, are starting to be released. Um, definitely uh, the guilt, you know, um, I mean, how illnesses and how destructive behaviors, each, each um, depending on the level of repressed feelings within the ego, like how much repressed uh, shame, guilt, and fear there are, um, they act like a magnet to the belief systems within the ego and the belief systems you can pick up from the collective consciousness, the collective ego. So let's say I'm dominating now, I'm doing some spiritual work, The Course of Miracles, and trying to sit with my feelings and do some meditation. And now the predominant feeling is like guilt. Um, the guilt acts a little bit like a radio station. So you'll pick up, uh, th uh, the, the belief systems will start to resonate from within your ego and from the collective radio, let's say the collective radio station, you pick it up from the, from the collective consciousness, like it's one big um, wavelength, if you like, uh, tuned to guilt, radio guilt. So it's like, well, uh, either I need punishment because I'm bad or the world needs punishment. So it might, I might go into, well, I'm gonna punish myself unconsciously with addiction I'm going to just watch, eat donuts, and um, and and just tell myself I'm horrible and and worthless nonstop. That's like radio guilt. Or I might I might just project it out. One of the ego mechanisms, rather than to internalize it, is to project it out onto others, and see that hey, everyone else in the world is guilty and they need punishment. So that person stole a donut; they should be hanged. Uh, I'm going to go on a crusade to say, to hang all the people who steal donuts in the world, and that will be my 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 ego mechanism of dealing with the guilt. Uh, depending on the level of repressed feelings, it might you know if there's too much repressed feelings, uh, the severity of the uh, belief system that expresses is more severe. So let's say uh, there's 
tremendous amounts of guilt and fear, and you're tuning into that at a very high, you know, with a very high level, then you'll be picking up life and death type thing, either uh, addictions or self-destructive mechanisms, or even the body will get uh, horrific illnesses like I did, kidney failure, organs failing, all kinds of things going wrong uh, because the level of repressed feelings and the ego inflation and the belief systems that I had been programmed with and that I pick up from the collective. I mean, I would say this, uh, this is a just in case anyone, just in case I get into trouble, say this video is for entertainment purposes, but you know, if there was a, if there was whatever the local illness, the current illnesses that's floating around in the media, it'd be quite easy to, um, to pick up that belief system because you know you're feeling guilty then you watch a tv show and they go yeah, these these people look like they're dying because they've got this illness so i think i'll have i'll do that one as well so that's how you can express really but um if you haven't got much if you're quite an advanced spiritual seeker you've cleared out all your fear and guilt you've been cancelling your beliefs doing the course in miracles letting go of all the thoughts you're holding in mind then you pro um, if you if you do have a batch of guilt or something, you probably just get a slight cough, which will be gone in a day, rather than like die of cancer within a week or something, have a life-threatening illness. So letting go of the repressed feelings. So the guilt, um, feeling the feeling is going to the observer of the guilt, releasing the guilt. Um, uh, the, be the belief systems that are activated, I'm bad, or are there any unconscious mechanisms going? Is there any addiction or destructive mechanisms going too much Netflix um, or um, uh, going on? Or is it, um, it could be low self-esteem type thoughts or, or the guilt could manifest in uh, projecting it outwards. Like, um, you know, who, who out there needs to be punished? Uh, let me go on a crusade to make sure these uh, guilty people get uh, punished. So it could get projected outwards. So those could be um, mechanisms uh, of dealing. So, but I would feel the feelings do the, uh, just uh, cancel, or it could be less than 14 of A Course in Miracles. God did not create this illness, so it's not real. God did not create those people as deserving of punishment, so that's not real either. So you can clear the thoughts and the repressed feelings out, and that will dissolve the guilt but it is very destructive um if you sense guilt coming up i would uh, work on clearing it the thoughts and and the feelings uh, underneath it okay, i'm going to press stop